this is Courtney and Kim again with fan service. And with us now is Corinne from Evil Beagle Games. Hey, want to give us a quick little intro about Eagle, Evil Beagle? That's going to be a tongue twister for me. Evil Beagle Games. Yes. Bad job, good games. Yes. Uh, Sean says it's the cleverest thing he's ever written. <laughs> um, sm small, just starting uh, publishing house. Uh, I mean, I know right now y'all are currently helping edit riffs for Savage Worlds, which makes me happy on yeah. so many levels. Yeah, I held back that by uh, a good bit, so I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, so, I mean, that must have been a fun experience, just getting to work on such a big project. I mean, y'all hit 300,000 a couple of days ago, as far as more. It might have been a few more than a couple, but hey. Yeah. I, um, as of last time I checked, we were at 330,000. Nice. It's good to see that game get some love. Because it's a good setting. It's just way too crunchy for most people these days. Yeah. Um, when Sean went to Michigan, gosh, uh, we were still living in Alabama. Oh, wow. um, no, we were still living in rural Alabama. <laughs> <laughs> Let's qualify that there. <laughs> uh, he drove. He was still working for Drive Through RPG, mm -hmm. and went up to Michigan to see Kevin Sambita mm -hmm. to convince him to put uh, Rift stuff mm -hmm. on Drive Through. Mm -hmm. uh, and while he was there, uh, talked to him about. Is there any possibility you might let me do a Savage Worlds version? <laughs> and most people are surprised at uh, the fact that he was allowed to. Mm -hmm. Most people just in the past have just done stuff without asking. This is one major case where the old saying it's easier to ask forgiveness than permission mm -hmm. is completely backwards. Yes. I mean, it's because it's, like I said, it's a good game system. You know that you helped edit it. It's just that the crunchy mechanics are a little much for some people. I know that mm -hmm. trying to create a character for the fantasy world, which is not technically riffs, I had to give up after like three or four hours because it was, there was something missing from something somewhere. But Savage Worlds is so easy. Oh. I can put together a character in five minutes. If that. If that. The and hardest part is determining what hindrances you want to take and mm -hmm. what edges yeah. or and how you want to spend your hindrance yeah. points, I or should OCD say. OCD like me, I have to have this huge backstory and a reason behind everything I'm taking. That's where all of my detail and time goes. Oh, yeah. It's like, but if I need to, like... Oh, that's oh, before I'm... I sit down with the paper. <laughs> I, I, I kind of have it in my mind when I sit mm -hmm. down and then I still go, damn, can I, can I do this and this? So. All right. Okay, so... What other things has Evil Beagle worked on, other than riffs? Because that's gonna be stuff. I know you're big in the uh, diversity community. You did a panel earlier on that. Yeah. And I'm asking like multiple questions at once. Uh, as far <laughs> as recent stuff, um, there's we recently did a uh, Strike Force mm -hmm. thing, which was superhero decades long running campaign nice. that Aaron Alston, who is from around this mm -hmm. area. We're familiar with Alston. Um, that he had done. Uh, this is a combination tribute homage mm -hmm. reworking nice. of that. Uh, which has been fascinating to watch oh. that come together. All right. uh, and then oh. Wrapping it up with the first half of that question, or the latter half of that question, I mean, that's got to be fun for you. You did a panel that, unfortunately, I had to miss. How was that panel, just throwing that out there today? Uh, it went well. It, it was kind of ironic, though. <laughs> a, a panel about diversity, and everyone on it was approximately my skin tone. <laughs> <laughs> but... Um, the fact that we are having these discussions mm -hmm. about women in gaming and people of color and LGBTQIA+. <laughs> <laughs> Just throw the whole alphabet in. I think it's pretty fun. <laughs> the alphabet suit that we are. All right. But, um, so where can we find you and Evil Beagle on the web? 
uh, evilbeaglegames.com. All right. And I'm guessing there are a couple of uh, Facebook pages out there. But again, this is Courtney, Corinne, and Kim for Pan Service. We'll see you later. No. I have a boba fetish. Let's go. Oh. I have a shirt. Oh. I need to get you that shirt too. It says I have What's a boba that? fetish. What's that? What's that? That's only because we haven't done that yet. Oh. <laughs>